Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome in today's video and today I would like to help you with one problem that I also faced because I was invested in uh, P Networks P Gala or uh, Gala that is on uh, Binance Ma Smart Chain. P Network came with a recovery plan in which we, you, you will be able to claim and redeem your P Gala for uh, Gala that is on Ethereum blockchain. But before I go into explanation how to do that, I would like just to go a little bit back and try to explain to the people that don't know what happened or some of you that maybe forgot what P Gala is with this article that was posted by P Network Steam on their Medium website you will be able to read this fully article on your own uh, and the link will be in the description i will use the text to text to audio here and let let uh, let us just uh, hear this first part of it possible preamble gala bip20 is the tokenized version of the gala token erc20 under normal circumstances, the tokenized version is pegged one-to-one -to, -one to the original version and redeemable for at any time. The function of the tokenized version of Gala, hereafter called Pala, is to make the token available on blockchain ecosystems, in this case BNB chain, different from the native blockchain where the token is issued, in this case Ethereum. Once the cross-chain bridge is set up and the P tokens version, in this case Pala, is set into existence, the asset is available for anyone to use it or integrate it without P Network needing to be aware of it. This includes, for example, the PALA support within DeFi platforms as well as the BIP20 deposit slash withdrawal support within centralized exchanges. Specifically, P Network was not involved in any listing activity of the PALA or GALA token on centralized exchanges. Important, the PALA token currently trading on DEXs and centralized exchanges may not be the one-to-one -one PEG token. As explained in the sections below, there are currently uncollateralized PALA in circulation, hence the publicly shared recommendations to not interact with it. The price of the currently trading uncollateralized PALA is worth approx. 0.0000109 BNB, approx $0.00038 at current BNB slash USD prices. Some so, that being said, as you heard here you don't want to trade that gala on uh, pancake swap or b swap or any other dex or uh, centralized exchange that offers them <clears throat> that being said i joined the uh, p networks uh, telegram community i asked there how i can recover my p gala and i was provided with good amount of information. <clears throat> I also tried it with my smaller wallet and it worked perfectly. But be aware, please, uh, do your own research because I think still this is risky to do. This is risky business, in my opinion. <clears throat> but still, I want to get my Gala off that uh, BSC as soon as possible. So this is from official P Networks uh, Twitter and I asked a couple times questions I got response and as I said in their uh, telegram I got huge amount of information that was needed for me to be sure in for me personally to do it but as I said you want to do your own research before you do any of these steps be aware that telegram is full of scammers and many 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 scammers will approach you so just contact the admins or just uh, talk to the admins in the telegram chat and if i go to notification this is uh in my opinion this is yeah ju just a scam but i was okay yeah so here is the link you know that they provided me <clears throat> and this is from official P network discord that being said let us just now go a little bit back and as I said I was really skeptical about it I still don't like the way how they handle this but I will 
show you. So here is the summary what everything that happened and how P Network addressed every single every single um, thing on that post mortem. Okay, they the article that I just read was posted by them. P Network post mortem claim. Okay, this is not it. This is it. And they put it here. To facilitate understanding of P Gala incident and recovery plan, we have published a new web page that answer frequently asked questions. We invite all users involved in the accident to browser it to better understand their situation. So that is this one. No, that, that's not this. Okay, this is the website and with frequently asked questions. So you have all the questions regarding it right here. This is that recovery page, but we will come in a short to that. And you can see that um, they did really, in my opinion, really bad job in handling this. But let us now go back to the to this website. So in, on this website, you can recover your old gala for new gala. And let's see, that is P gala settlement agreement concluded between the eligible P gala token holder as defined here under C and P network team. Both here, here and after referred to as parties preamble Pigala BEP20 is the tokenized version of Gala. Okay, they, they, they are now explaining what is Pigala. P Network. Okay, this is now just uh, putting into wording what we just have. What happened and why they take this action as they take. This is now explaining how the distribution will go. So, all Pigala token holders that own Pigala during both of the following two snapshots block on November 3rd, 2022 and the second block on 7th November 2022 are eligible to exchange the P gala that they held on the first snapshot and continue to hold the on the second snapshot with the new fully collateral, collateralized P gala token provided they agree to the terms of this settlement agreement. And this is the thing that I wasn't really sure about because they said they will airdrop the tokens to our own addresses. But what we see here is that P Gala is lawyering up. They don't want to get sued by the investors. So they are just putting this settlement agreement and you can read it fully, this link, will be also in the description or I, I will just um, put their uh, Twitter handle and this article and you will be able to read all the steps what happened and decide if you want to use this or not. So after you read all of this, you know, it's just that they, 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 want, they don't want to get sued. I go to accept, connect, I'll use MetaMask. Okay, the prompt didn't pop up for me, so let me just check again. Okay, so the problem was I didn't connect my proper wallet to it. So you can see here down below, accept and claim 31k P Gala. So I'll just go on that. The prompt will be on my right side and be sure that you can that, that you read you know the contract and everything as i said i didn't i don't like how they managed to do it i was also banned from their uh, telegram because i was suspicious about it but hey you can't blame me add p gala to your wallet i'll add that token to the list 
and this is actually their uh, explanation how you can do it or step-by-step -step guide that is being created to help eligible users to face technical difficulties in claiming the PGALA. So everything that I said now or that I showed you is explained here. You want to go to, to their website, you go and accept the agreement, you connect your uh, wallet, you accept and claim it, confirm the transaction. I can confirm the transaction was uh, processed as I can see it in my wallet. And then the users, okay, I added also the token. You can also use this address and you can check out the new token. So how do we, <coughs> so how do we redeem P Gala for Gala on Ethereum? We must go to their uh, P Network D app. <clears throat> be, <clears throat> be sure to read here, you know, P Network is a new technology and security audits don't eliminate the risk completely. Please do not provide assets you can't afford to lose. <clears throat> so we will go with the Binance Smart Chain. We go with Gala. And you can see that Gala on Binance Smart Blockchain 31k. We put that max address that we want to send it so let me just grab the address i will probably uh i mean i don't even need to but let's put the address and we want to swap p network bridge is new and complex technology while it has undergone security audits that doesn't eliminate the risk completely. Please do not bridge large amount of assets you can't afford to lose. By proceeding, you understand the risks and are responsible for any lost funds. So we want to accept the terms. The prompt will be on our right side. The gas is 12 cents. And I'll just check again the address fully BA. Let me check this. Yep. It is. So I'll just confirm it. And we can now follow the transaction. So transaction is broadcasted. Waiting for confirmation. This shouldn't take uh, a long time to process. As I said, okay, confirm transactions. Let us pop that on waiting for the P network to de detect your transaction. So now the bridge needs to send us Gala on Ethereum on our address. So we will just wait a couple minutes. When you join the Telegram group, please be more, <coughs> more careful than I did to not say the things that I said obviously because that got me banned because I was suspicious you can't blame me for that in crypto you need always to be careful you know because there is a lot of scams that are going so we will just wait if this takes a long time I will probably cut the video to that point where the transaction is completed and after a couple minutes you can see that the transaction is confirmed. Please be careful in every step that you do. Before you do any of these steps, do your due diligence. Check P Network, check Gala. Go through the articles, read it carefully, watch the contact address, watch everything, transactions, and then you can proceed and do these things. Be carefully. I'm not a financial advisor or, or, or financial advi investor or investment or financial advisor. So please be cautious. Do this at your own risk. If you don't feel uh, safe doing this, I would just say then, uh, you know, sit back and wait for them, you know, to come with uh, more information or demand more information from them. Don't be, push, don't be pushy as I was to get banned on the, their telegram. 
but at least I got my gala back. Thank you for your attention, ladies and gentlemen, and see you in the next videos.